I'm gonna do it. I'm doing it. You, 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 you don't, don't try and stop me. Uh, here I go. Okay. I bounce on a starfish, but I'm, I'm sinking. I'm sinking. Get down there. There we go. And we're stuck. How about that, folks? Polar bear tank underwater. We can't. I'm pressing the B button. You can't. You can't crap in the pool. That's that's just offensive. It won't let the game won't let you do that because you gotta have manners when you're playing a video game. But if you, you can come out underwater, and then what the hell? Okay, and then you can you can crawl on land and get to the walrus, or you can go back over to a fish. It's weird because on land the ship doesn't take as much damage as like a the fish on land does, but then you can cuddle with me forever, polar bear. Forever. And always. But alright, it's Ant Lion Alpha and enough fooling. And there you can see the hyena's death meter going down again. Or health meter. Whatever. And then we got these little pillars of stepping. Steppin' pillars make me want to step on them because they're steppin' pillars. And we've got the the log ride logs. Couldn't get a new polygon for these logs, but whatever. You use whatever logs you need. And then there's an orb right there. Then there should be four left, if I'm not mistaken. And I rarely am mistaken. Who's ever seen me mistaken? Not you. Not any of my viewers have seen me mistaken. Now I've 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 mistaken plenty of times. And here's another key. And this is the hardest jump in the level right here. You saw those like narrow little st jumps we had to make across the bridge, but yeah, this one's annoying because you have to time it like at the very edge. And okay, we got it. You have to do it like when the vine's swinging towards you, kind of. Or you can just do it better. Alright. Here we go, leap of vine. Not leap of faith, but leap of vine, because it's more relevant to vines than faith, because who needs faith to, when you're talking about vegetation? Not I. Said even the gardener. Even the gardener doesn't need no faith when he's gardening. He just needs his trowel and some fertilizer. And we're gonna jump on this next swing. Get ready to jump with us. Oh, so that's how you do it. No, I don't. I, don't, I, I knew. I knew all along, I just didn't do it quite right at all. And then there's this, this last ring, you can just do that. Simple. And you can't appear inside the trophy for this one. Simply impossible for this level. You will not succeed if you try to go from that last ring, or any of the rings you choose to be your last to the trophy. You will have to just venture towards there on another trip. Alright. So then we've got our last orbs here, our last key here, and our last trophy of the level. And I'll show you where that is. That you got your key elevator. We'll go there soon enough. Uh uh okay. Landing on a log. Always a nice day when you land on a log. So let's walk through this little veg vegetable. Yes, that was a nice vegetable shower I just took. Going through that. Alright, so then you come here. And here's your vine. And it's real simple just to swing across onto the gold. Swing for the gold. Don't just go for the gold, but swing for it. And I, I don't think I've ever been able to actually... I'm sure you could, but like I've I've never actually like landed on the 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 stump. I've always just bounced off the trophy, and it looks hilarious. So I'll meet you by the key platform. Actually, I'll just meet you to this point because 
there's a little special thing just for the gorilla right here. Yeah, he's got his little shortcut. So you don't have to go from the log. Yeah, it sure is a shortcut. There we go. All right. And the key elevator platform just be up here. You ever wonder why sometimes you can't... Like an elevator jam is just not going anywhere? Well, that's because those people didn't bring their three keys. You, get, you gotta bring your three keys when you're going on an elevator. Okay. So now we're off to the bonus level, which is fairly challenging. High score, 1,000 points. Okay. Shouldn't be too bad. Listen up. In this zone, there's a long line of obscure puzzles to solve, deadly traps to negotiate, an idol to steal, a big Raleigh rock to avoid. Oh, what is what is this? See, ripping off of Raiders of the Lost Ark. Don't do that. Don't ever do that. Be your own thing. All right, so there goes Evo, and we're supposed to like hunt him down. What are you doing, Evo? Alright, so, yeah, we have to, like, hunt hunt all the animals, and the chameleons far away look like little... Ritz crackers. Oh, so, yeah, we... Or it's not a machine we use, but it's, like, a gun thing. It's really cool. Yeah, we can... The B button to speed up, we don't really need to do that. Uh, small... Okay, so how this thing works... Uh, damn it. Didn't get anything there. I don't know what I'm gonna see. This is hard. You kinda need to just focus on it. Okay, what's happening? Don't slow to a halt. Alright, let's try this again then. Uh,. Yeah, I tried it. It's actually not my second time, just only my second time trying this. I, As you can see, there's a new best score. So, and I, I'm doing phenomenally better already. But, yeah. Uh, I, I tried doing this, like, many times and it always froze by the time like the hyena got to like around the top of the hill and now it's much better and I can't really talk at all but yeah it would freeze at the same spot and I like looked up solutions wasn't really finding anything and finally I decided to to just uh, I, I changed the default memory size of the emulator to, what is it, to, to 8 me megabytes instead of 4, so now it's working a lot better, and if you haven't, I, what I was trying to explain like three times, but didn't get to, because I kept like interrupting myself, is, is that, uh, the smaller the animal is, the more points you get, the bigger ones, like the elephant and the gorilla, uh, you don't really get much points for. And thankfully I got a lot of points from those. Last time, my first playthrough that I went the whole way around this level, I didn't get uh, any of the piranha in both the pools. Yeah, there's another pool of piranha we'll be seeing. So let's get these tortoise. I think you see like every animal from the jungle except for the tortoise tank. We don't be we won't be seeing that and but we see like all the small animals, all the big ones. We see more hippos. We see like five hippos or something like that. See how many piranha we can get. There's this mini game will be coming up pretty shortly that I really suck at. It's not really a mini game, but it's like a Yeah, it's this thing right here. It's like I don't know what you call this thing. But See if I can do any better at it, and uh, why can't I hit that? All right, I should just go for the hyena, like because chameleons are obviously worth the most most points. 
but I don't seem to be able to hit them at all. Or the, the chameleons or the tortoises. I was, like before recording this, I was saying, you know, it would be smart if I went for the tortoise because it's not too little and it's not and a lot. I've probably I probably would have gotten I'm probably I've probably probably already got more points than I would have if I had just been going for the tortoise or the hyena. I probably would have gotten zero because my first time around this I got zero. And I think the score you need to beat is ten thousand. So I don't know why it starts you starts saying the score to it, the best score is one thousand. So that's really lying, I guess. But yeah, and the thing is, if you if you replay this level, uh, you have to beat this this your own high score in order to win. So, or you could just like play until you beat a thousand again and say, "Oh, I would have beaten it if I this is my first time." And then when you get to the end and it's like, "Oh, sorry, you didn't score enough points," you'd be like, "Oh, you're lying," because I scored enough points the first time around. And, you can pretty much get all these animals, no problem. These big ones, they... Like, most animals... take four hits. Except some of the... weaker ones. I don't know why the chameleon takes so many hits, I guess, because it's worth a lot of points, but the, the parrots, which are at the very end, take one hit. And I'm pretty sure I'm gonna do it, because I think the parrots are worth a thousand points each, and there's two of them, and... I usually get both of them, because they're not that hard to miss. And the lions, how much are they worth? If I can get them, which I can't. Okay. I think the lion's worth like 200, something like that. They're the right size for it. There's going to be a w another one peeking your way. Oh, 300, cool. Even better. 300 be better than 200, I say. Yeah, I was so worried that I wouldn't be able to finish this Let's Play because the game kept freezing, but good thing the solution wasn't too hard. Okay, can I want to get the lion before I open the missile? If I can, there we go. I won't worry about that lion, because then there's these chameleons, which are worth 500 each. One of them's probably Evo. I don't get the whole Evo becoming these things yet. And yeah, I've, now I've, I've won. See if I can still get the parrots, though. Because they get really close to the camera, so it shouldn't be hard. Oh, wow, I got the other one. Oh, and I got both of them. Cool. I usually, the one that was farther out, I usually get second, so that was kind of cool. Yeah, that's a pretty high score. Usually, I think my highest score before this was, like, somewhere, like, 12,000. I don't know when I've gotten 13,000 before, but that better be enough. I don't think it's higher than 10,000. So let's shoot the ceiling metal thing. I know where you are. I know where you are. Alright, so we're good. Oh yeah, now that we've won, we have to kill Evo. Oh, now I get it. I, I just forgot this because it's been so long since I've actually played it and won. I'm pretty sure you have unlimited time, though. That'd be kind of cruel if you made you have to restart this if you didn't get him within an amount of time. But yeah. Come on, Evo. Yeah, we're, we're, this is the first level and only level where we play as the other guy. I don't know, his, I don't remember his name, if he even has one. Wait, I think he does. I think it's like Dan. He has not it Dan? Yeah. Come on. I'm pretty sure you can... Yeah, you can kill him when he's... Uh, uh, invisible, which I did. Alright, so there we go. That was rough. Well, not really doing that, but the whole thing with the glitch freezing. So thanks for coming. Hopefully my commentary didn't sound boring, because I was, like, annoyed after... Buh, 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 buh. But anyway, enjoy your day. This is my last time recording for a couple days, because I'm going to be going somewhere... So bing bang goodbye for a while.